do contain low nicotine. It's at 3 mg. I'm kind of um, intolerant to nicotine, so it's gonna be hard for me to test all these flavors with nicotine in it. Let's try again. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today, we have yet another local juice line. This time, it's from Born to Drip. So these are babies of Born to Vape um, vape shop in Kazan City. They have four flavors, so if you are interested to know more about these flavors, please keep on watching. Okay, so for today's review, I will be using this Smop X Cube Mini with my Goon RDA. Let's start with Yankee Cake. I would assume that this is New York Cheesecake. Okay, so let's try vaping Yankee Cakes. Okay, so let me just put some more and try it again. Let's do this. Flavor-wise, this doesn't have much flavor. I would say it's um a little bland, but maybe that's what you get with New York cheesecake. Yankee cake is basically New York cheesecake, and I haven't really tasted any New York cheesecake flavored e-juice that has so much flavor. So it's normally pretty bland. The sweetness is very low. There's a slight hint of creaminess, but um, overall, it pretty much reflects what a New York cheesecake e-juice should be. Okay, so according to the flavor description, it says here, Yankee cake is an exquisite New York cheesecake topped with caramel that will make you crave for days. So the caramel isn't really there. Um, as compared to the other caramel e juices that, that I've tried, um, sweetness is very low. So if you don't like e juices that are too sweet, I think this one is okay for you. Yagi cake. Next flavor, we have Banana Berry Sunday. So this one smells so good from the bottle. Okay, so according to the flavor description, Banana sundae with a hint of strawberry for an explosion of flavor and goodness. So let's try vaping it. Okay. <clears throat> this is a little more sweet than your cheesecake. But um, I guess that would be coming from the strawberry. Although it's when you vape it, the smell of banana would come off stronger versus the strawberry. It's a good mixture of fruity flavored <clears throat> e juice. <clears throat> I just can't appreciate the flavor that much because there's nicotine, and I don't really like nicotine, but. Overall, if you enjoy vaping with nicotine and you like fruity flavors, I think Banana Berry Sunday is a good pick. Moving on, we have Oreo Milkshake. This one smells like chocolate. And you guys know how much I don't like chocolate. So I hope this would work okay. The chocolate is not that pronounced when you try to fire it, so we'll see if it translates well while vaping it. Okay, according to the flavor description, Oreo milkshake is Oreo mixed 
with the creamy goodness of milk and vanilla ice cream to make the final form of the Oreo milkshake. Let's try it. This tastes so much like chocolate. <clears throat> like a strong, no, like dark chocolate. I would say if you enjoy chocolate flavored e-juices, I think this would sit well with you. But since I personally don't like chocolate and anything that is flavored with it, I'm not really digging this. Although I noticed that I'm more tolerable with the nicotine <laughs> blend from this e-juice as compared to the second one, which made me cough so much while vaping Banaberry. And finally, we have Donatella. This one is cleverly named. Donatella is Nutella-infused glazed donuts that fulfills every sweet tooth's dream. I'm not really into Nutella because Nutella is just hazelnuts and chocolate, but we'll try it. This one is quite darker than the rest, and I'm intimidated by dark e juices, so we'll see. We'll see how different Donatella is from Oreo milkshake. Let's try vaping it. <coughs> okay, so this one has more nutty taste in it. Um, I was hoping, or first impression would tell me that Donatella must be chocolate donut. Then again, since this has nuts in it, then that's where you draw the nutty flavor. So comparing Donatella with Oreo milkshake, Oreo is more chocolatey, while Donatella is more nutty versus being a um, chocolate Nutella flavor. Sweetness is not really in there. I would say the sweetest among these is still banaberry, but um, I guess that's what makes each flavor different from each other. So you have Yankee cake if you want creamy or some gentle flavored e juice. You'd probably pick banaberry cake if you want something fruity and sweet. And if you're into chocolate, which most Filipinos are, you would probably get Oreo milkshake. And finally, if you enjoy nutty flavored e juices, then go ahead and try Donatella. Okay, so for this line, my top two would be Yankee Cake and Banaberry Sunday. Just because I'm not really into chocolate flavored e juices and nutty flavored e juices. And if given that these are not laced with nicotine, I would probably enjoy Banaberry Sunday the most because I like fruity and strawberry is one of my favorite. Um, flavors plus i love that um this one has um the scent of bananas in it but the taste of strawberry so it's quite a good blend okay so born to drip is sold at 200 pesos for 30 mils or 50 mils i'm not quite sure i'll double check it if i can find the info and, and i'll put it down below in the item description these are at 70 30 vgpg blend and it comes in only one nicotine level, so that's 3mg. Okay, so since I don't normally vape e juices that has nicotine in it, I've decided to put the entire line for a giveaway. Since these are four bottles, I will be picking two winners, one from YouTube and another from Facebook. I will be putting the full instructions down below in the item description. I think the instructions are pretty much the same, so if if you are not new to my channel, you know what to do, you know the drill. I will be picking the winner by next week, so good luck. Anyway, I guess that's all for today. If you've enjoyed watching this review, don't forget to hit thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you in my next review video. Bye!